are speaking with. Ryan. And I'm Joel. We're from Airborne. How you going? You guys are touring with the Joe Perry Project and Motley Crue across Canada right now. Any war stories thus far? Oh, the bus of death. The bus of death story, I guess I could tell you. Um, basically, there's nine of us on the bus. Seven of us currently have been wiped out by some sort of crazy little bug on the bus. We some, don't know crazy, it's, it's, it's some crazy thing is on the bus. It's like a, I don't know, it's like some alien or something just in there <laughs> just killing everybody during the night. Wake up in the morning, did you get hit last night? Yeah, and you're just throwing up. It's just, just throwing up. Really, like, all night long. I think I've eaten for five days. You know, it's just, yeah. you can't sleep. It's like a, insomnia as well. Um, it's just this crazy thing. I don't yeah. know. So there's, there's a little more story. It's picked up in Quebec or something. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, before that. Well, yeah, I don't, we don't know where it came <laughs> from. It's on the bus. Fair enough. And No Guts, No Glory, the new Airborne album, comes out in March. Yep. Why should people come back to this record a few years after Running Wild? What is, it, what is this record going to do for them? This record, uh, No Guts, No Glory, is harder, faster. It's, uh, it's got more of a lot. We slept in the studio, um, you know, so we're, we're there every step of the way. If you want more Airborne, you're going to get more Airborne this time around. And uh, it's, it's a rock and roll album. Um, it's from the heart, and it's for you. All right. And fair end, finally... In what way is Airborne going to help people out of the misery of this recession we're going through? Well, you know, I think the, the recession and all that sort of stuff, you know, um, uh, rock and roll resistance will live on. And uh, if you're looking for a good time, you're looking to get pissed, you know, drunk, uh, as we say in Australia, pissed, um, uh, and you, look, you want to get laid, uh, you know, come to a rock and roll show, you know, everyone will be having a good time. Uh, forget about all the troubles. You might, you, you know, it's, um, it's tough for everybody out there, but I tell you what, at the rock and roll show, it's all good. Thank you very much, Alvin. Thanks, man.